Hi there, thank you for joining me. I'm just going to show you a few little um, moves that we can do to strengthen and mobilise if you've got a bad knee. Okay, so let's just pop on our backs when you're ready. Okay, so let's just bring in our tummy and squeeze the pelvic floor. Let's bring one knee just gently up towards the ceiling. So we're going to have our ankle in line with our knee. We're going to have our knee directly over our hip. We're going to imagine we've got a pencil poking out of the top of the knee. We're going to relax the head and the shoulders. We're going to gently circle this hip. We're keeping the knee really steady and we're just circling. So we're just pushing that leg out to the side, just slightly, and then back again. Exhale as we move away and inhale back. Nice and steady, bringing in the tummy, squeezing that pelvic floor. Just gently mobilising and stretching. So we're building up strength and stability around that knee joint. We're building up strength in this thigh muscle. If you've got a bad knee, really important that we build up strength in this thigh muscle to support that knee. Let's just go a couple more times. Exhale as you move away. Inhale back. Exhale away. And inhale back. Okay, let's pop that foot down onto the floor. So we've done one leg, let's swap legs when you're ready, bringing the other leg up now. So again, we're going to gently circle. So just mobilising and stretching, breathing in and out, in and out. So again, working this thigh, imagine that pencil. It's only about the size of a tennis ball, it's not very big, it's just mobilising. Taking your time, in and out, in and out. Okay, let's pop that leg down when you're ready. Obviously you can do another set if you wanted to, so maybe doing a couple of sets each time will just again build up strength in this thigh muscle. Now we're going to get a little bit of mobility and strength in that knee by hugging the shin, pointing the toe gently, and then we're going to extend that leg out. So we're stretching. Let's hug the shin, point the toes, and then extend that leg out. We're going to inhale and then exhale. Inhale, bring that knee in, and then exhale, extending out. Breathing in and out. So mobilising the knee and stretching. Again, we're stretching the front of the knee, we're stretching through the back of the knee, all the way down the thighs and into the hip flexor. So if you're a little bit stiff in the knee, it's really good to do. And then when you extend out, we're just, we're just stretching and we're stabilising around that knee joint. Let's go this last one and we're going to relax. Let's bring the other leg just into tabletop. We're going to hook the shin, point the toes, and extend that leg out. Exhale and inhale. Exhale as the leg moves away. Inhale as that knee comes in. Nice and steady, bringing in the tummy, squeezing that pelvic floor. Just taking your time in and out. Okay, let's just go a couple more times now. You can obviously do another set of each if you wanted to. So another set on each leg. Just mobilise and strengthen. Okay, so let's relax when you're ready. So now we're going to come onto our fronts. Now if you've got a bad back, you can lie with your head just resting down. Or you can come onto your elbows if you want a little bit more of a stretch. So now we're going to mobilise and strengthen by just bending the knee, bringing the toes up towards the ceiling, and then we're going to gently relax down. Let's swap legs, alternating which leg we do, and back again. Exhale, coming up. Inhale, back down. Exhale, coming up. Inhale, back down. Nice and steady really stretching. So great for stretching from the ankle through the knee to the hip. We're also building that strength and stability around that knee joint. It's nice and supported by being on the floor and we're working the hamstrings. Exhale and inhale. Nice and steady, bringing in that tummy, squeezing 
in that pelvic floor. Okay, so let's make our next one our last one. And we're nice. Okay, let's come back into seated position. So those exercises are really good to do if you've got a bad knee. You could do them every day to build up strength and stability in, in the knee joint. You won't even need to turn the phone on or your, your computer. You will be able to memorise them. They're just a few exercises that will really help you if you suffer with knee pain. Thank you for joining me and I hope to see you soon. Bye bye.